Did you know that in order to help a turtle cross the road, you just have to treat them like a sweet old lady? Today we're going to show you how. If you see a turtle crossing the road, the first thing you should do is, if it's safe to do so, pull over to the side of the road. Then check it over to make sure it isn't injured. If it is, bring it to your local wildlife rehabilitation center so they can take care of it. Don't attempt to nurse back to health a wild turtle yourself. If it's fine, then you can help it cross. It's very important to move the turtle in the same direction it was already headed. If you pick up that turtle, turn it around, and put it back on the side it came from, it's just going to turn around and cross the road again. Think of if you saw an old lady crossing the road. You would safely pull over. Oh sweet, an old lady crossing the road. Let me just pull over here. Make sure she's okay. Do, do you need help, old lady? Doesn't look like anything hit her. What okay, I think doing? we're good, I think we're good. Check which direction she's headed, and then help her continue going in that same direction across the road. Hey, let me help you out. Okay, you on the side of the road you need to be on now? I guess, thank you. Awesome, well have a great day. You wouldn't pick her up, turn her around, and put her back on the side she came from, right? Then she would just have to start all over again. I want to go that way. The same thing goes for turtles. They know which direction they need to go. It's also very important to simply leave the turtle on the other side of the road. You don't want to pick them up, put them in your trunk, drive them across town, and let them go in a pond because that's where you think they should go. What are you doing out here? This is all cornfield, dude. Let's bring you somewhere better. Well, into the trunk. Here, this is where you belong. Chances are they'll shortly leave that body of water, totally confused because they're lost, and most relocated reptiles don't survive long term. I mean, if you saw an old lady crossing the road, you wouldn't pick her up, put her in your trunk, drive her across town, and let her loose where you think she belongs. I got the perfect place for you. Who are you? Okay. Why? In the trunk, in the trunk with you. Ugh. I got the perfect place for you. Don't you worry, old lady. I'm gonna bring you to where all the other old people are. It's gonna be perfect for you. Oh, you've gotten heavier. I picked you up. All right. Bye. You might even find some of your friends and relatives here. Good deed done. Where am I? Oh yeah, you're also gonna need this. No, you would help her just cross the road and let her continue on her journey to the bingo hall. Although most turtles will let you help them cross with ease, snapping turtles, like some old ladies, don't appreciate the help. So if you come across a snapping turtle crossing the road, just pick them up by their back legs and have them face away from you while you carry them across the road. However, doing that to an old lady will probably end up in a lawsuit. And finally, if you see a turtle crossing the road, do not remove it from the wild to keep as a pet. I mean, you wouldn't take an old lady from the road to keep. If you would like to have a pet turtle, I recommend reaching out to your local herpetological society or reptile rescue because they are often overridden with aquatic turtles needing homes. And if you're looking for an old lady, I recommend checking out your local nursing home. But that, in a nutshell, is how you help turtles cross the road safely. The key points here are to A, make sure it's safe for you to help them out. Your safety comes first. Don't go across a four-lane highway to help a turtle as much as you'd like to you've got to keep your own safety a priority and if you are helping them out just move them in the same direction they're already going and leave them on the other side nature will tell them where to go but i hope you learned something new today and as always we'd like to thank our wonderful patreon backers for their very generous support and thank you for watching go help those turtles and old ladies <laughs> although most turtles will let you help them really <laughs> Although most turtles will let you help them cross the road with... Really? You gotta... In the, in the trunk. In the trunk, old lady. Why are you doing this? You might also need this. Uh, I might have to redo that excited. You don't want to pick them up, put them in your trunk, drive them across town, and let them go in a... <clears throat> Can't get this line down. Society or reptile rescue to see if they have one available for... A Really? With a knife? The shot. That was just distract you. So first. distracting. <laughs> I thought you were gonna come out with a knife too. No, I was <laughs> what she was doing. You got heavier. <laughs> You've got heavier. So I picked you up. Check it over to make sure it isn't injured. If it is, then bring it to your local wildlife rehabilitation center and let them take care of it and release it. What are you doing? That's terrifying! You're worse than the gnome! Oh my gosh, an old lady. Okay, she's alright. Any any injuries? What? Nope, nope she's she looks fine. Okay, good. Going on? We can we can do better we can dang it. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> <laughs> uh, I have to hunch more anyway. Okay. It's okay. <laughs>